Sinn Féin has called for a referendum on a united Ireland following the abortion poll. Vice President Michelle O'Neill said constitutional issues had gained renewed prominence following Friday's yes vote on scrapping the Eighth Amendment and allowing abortions. She told IDV's Peston on Sunday, I think in terms of the conversation at home now it's very much about a union referendum, it's very much about the constitutional future. The big decision, on Friday, was a constitutional issue, that is now to the fore. People, particularly people from a unionist background who traditionally in the past wouldn't have had this conversation about where they see themselves in the future, are now having that conversation and it's a very healthy and live debate. Sinn Féin leader Mary Lou McDonald, R, and Deputy Leader Michelle O'Neill, L, hold up a placard which reads, The North is next, as the result of the Irish abortion is declared, image, Getty, as part of the 1998 Good Friday Agreement, the British government accepted the principle of consent, meaning the people of the North could decide their own future on the issue. It recognized the legitimacy of the aspiration for a united Ireland as well as the wish of a majority to remain part of the UK. New Root poll reveals 49% of Irish people want a united Ireland. Theresa May's administration has said the time is not right to call a poll on uniting Ireland. Nationalists have claimed the Brexit result, which Northern Ireland voted against, has reinvigorated the debate. Mrs O'Neill said the test had been met for a unity poll. She added, I think the fact that if you look at a number of things, the northern state was built on a unionist majority, that unionist majority is now gone.